Hey, what's up, Janky here? I've got, uh, I'm a slide guitar player. I love playing slide, and I, uh, I we, we drink a lot of wine here. We have a lot of bottles and things like that. So um, I decided to buy this Creators Bottleneck Cutter. So also pay attention if you go on Amazon or something like that, because there's a lot of bottle cutters out there that you can cut something like this and make it into a glass. This, this is not, this is not that. This is strictly for bottleneck cutting. So this on Amazon, it's pretty cheap. What it comes with is this mechanism here, like this. And it comes with this file. Which, um, so I've been trying to hone in and, and uh, figure out the best way to do this. And I've done different methods and um, you don't want to overheat it. You get this, which these are all still usable slides for me. Um, here's another one that you can see there's a crack. Yeah, there's a crack straight up through that one. Um, I just tried this one. I was doing another video and it didn't come out. This this one would have been really cool. Um, but it, it actually works out pretty well because it's got an indention um, for kind of where my finger meets there. And so it, it's cool. It's really big. Um, I kind of like these because they, they can, um, but you can also customize it to your perfect length. So I've got my finger kind of poking out of that one. And here's probably the best one I did, and it's just clean. And sh if you play something like a two two string cigar box guitar or one string, this is perfect, and it just fits perfectly on my finger. So this is from a standard wine bottle like this, Scout and Cellar. If you want to get some, um, and another kind of beveled one or a little fluted. And again, it got really hot, so I'm going to do it straight in the directions they have and see how it works. Okay, so the way this works is we have to score this and then we use what's called thermal shock. That sounds like an 80s metal band, but hey, it works. So you can adjust this uh, screw down to the length that you want the slide to be. So I've got it down there. Um, and by the way, this is an amazing wine as well. So it's one of our favorite wines. So I thought I'd make it into a, a slide. Um, so what you do is, on this, there's a little, uh, it's a glass cutter right there. So the instructions say that you put it on here and you just score it 360 degrees. So don't overscore it, that's the first mistake I did. And it says you rotate it clockwise, so that is this way. So here you go, let me get that out of the way. So I'm just going to score it one part. And I could take a marker and mark it right here, but I'm going to put it right at the beginning of this label right here. So I'm gonna go around 360 degrees clockwise. So we need to make it all the way back to there. So that is scored, not overscored, straight up just scored, score. So now it says to take a candle, like rotate the bottle approximately a half an inch above the candle for one minute, depending on the thickness of the glass. It's also important to have on standby a big glass of ice cold water. So let's see how this works. So I'm just gonna put it a half inch above the flame. I'm gonna rotate it for one minute. So that's one minute, and now you dunk it. Thermal shock. It's close. It's really close. No, it's not there all the way yet. You don't want to get too hot, man. No, it's very unrock and roll. Do 30 seconds this time.
fucking hot. Here we go. Sometimes it'll make a pop. Sometimes you can see that it is pinned, it's making its way all the way through the bottle. Yet. I heard it pop. Bam! Clean. That is clean and smooth, so it took a little longer than a minute. Um, but that is gonna be a cool slide. Yeah, dog. Cool bottle, Cooper the Thief. A Cooper is the person that makes uh, barrels. So now, I'm gonna dry her off. And uh, so you can see that it's, I mean, it's pretty thick, but uh, you know, it's a little sharper on the edges. So, you know, I'm just gonna, Bam. Perfect slide for two string, one string, three string, cigar box. Creators bottleneck cutter. Dig it. <laughs>